Welcome back to Circuits V2 Tutorials. Today I'm going to be talking about the Raycast chip, and I don't even know where to start with it. I don't know where to find it. You can find it in the Physics tab under Circuits. I think that this is one of the most helpful chips. Not most helpful, there's certainly other ones. But this one's one of the most fun to play around with. So, to start off, I'm just going to grab a, one of my own little things that's very helpful whenever creating games. I don't know if I have it published or not, but if you want me to, I can. So, on start position, that would be where you want the Raycast to start, because basically what the Raycast does is... It will start here, right, and then it will take this direction and just shoot a line out from here and see if it hits any objects, where it hits, and like the distance. So right now, because it's the max distance is zero, it's not hitting anything, but if we set this to, let's say, four, ooh, it's still not hitting anything. No, that's why, because I have the up vector. Sorry, sorry. See, and now it's hitting something. It's hitting the sandbox wall. And so it's outputting that object, the distance from that object, the hit position, and I could not tell you what that is. I'm sorry. Okay, so I'm fairly certain that a button is considered an object. So see if we point it at the button, then it will output that said button. So, that's, that's everything about the Raycast, pretty much. Um, yeah, I'd say it's decently cool. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please subscribe. And if you didn't understand something, please comment it down below. I can probably help you out. And, uh, anyways, happy circuiting.